Hey guys, welcome back to Redneck Garage. Hope y'all enjoy this one. Uh, make sure you get down there and hit a like, share, and subscribe so you can enjoy the fun content that we are going to bring to everybody. So, anyway, um, I know you're probably like, what did I just watch? Well, we're gonna take this boat trailer this old uh, boat trailer that we got for probably next to nothing, can't say. Um, and we're going to trade it for a golf cart that you guys are going to see on the YouTube screen here. On the inner screen, um, it's an electric golf cart. It's been sitting in the woods. It's not in half bad shape. It's not in the greatest, but... It's uh, in the shape that we need it to be for our content. But we're going to see what we got to do to turn that electric golf cart into a gas powered golf cart. I don't know if it's going to have reverse or not because most of the electric ones had reverse through the motor, not the transmission. But we'll see. It's a golf cart. We really don't need reverse or anything like that. So, but all right, stay tuned. We're almost there guys. I wanted to show you guys the beautiful scenery. Um, I don't know if he's gonna let us record or not. If he does, you won't see this part, probably. I, I don't know. But uh, I'm gonna ask him. I wanted to show you guys this road. I can't show you too much because destination's up ahead. But this is just one of the most beautiful roads around us and it is fun. To drive especially in the side-by-sides and especially street bikes this is just an awesome road uh, people fly on it though um, it's kind of kind of makes it a little dangerous but it's fun I know I'm guilty of flying my Honda Accord when I had it but yeah just a little update on the trip and wish us luck I'll see if he'll let us record all right, hang in there. What's up guys? We are on our way home. We got the golf cart. Um, I didn't ask him if I could record. Um, there was kids outside and uh, I don't like to record other people's kids if I can help it on my channel. So that's an update. I think you guys are going to be excited for this build. And uh, keep watching. About to see.
No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No. 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 Hell no. 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 I refuse. No. No. this pile of poopy that we're gonna turn into something really cool and uh, Laura's been wanting one haven't you mm-hmm so I got her one straight out of the woods has sticks and all sticks leave well most of the leaves blew off going down the road um, the seats are in great shape they don't look bad no they, they need cleaned clean. up Looks like a couple little tears, but uh, probably recover that. And listen, guys, listen. This electric golf cart, no batteries. I don't even know if the motor's there. The frame's rusty and needs repair, but the price was right. You guys seen what we traded for this thing. Both parties are happy, and I already knew what this was when I was going to get it. But, the more support you guys show me on these videos, the more we'll do to this thing. It's getting a Harbor Freight engine. I want to know what engine that you want to go in it. I think a 670 would be too much, plus it would cost a lot. Um, but, the more support you guys show, if you want to donate any parts, any tires, any rims, if you want to donate a motor, that'd be awesome. Um, if you just want to donate something to PayPal or join my Patreon page, I have links to those down below the video. But the more you guys show support on this build, it's going to be awesome. I promise you. If you haven't seen the other golf cart that used to look like this, that we did up go watch it it's one of my very first videos it turned out really good that was when i was really new to the youtube thing so the videos aren't that great they're they're mostly pictures but you'll get the hint you'll you'll see what redneck can do and we want to make it nice i'm even thinking about getting rid of this body pile of shit get rid of that body and doing a tube chassis with a tube body. I mean, at that point, it's not even a golf cart anymore. But, you know, possibilities are endless around here in this garage. Winter's coming. Snow is going to be flying in the next couple months. And I needed something that would keep me and you content. And I plan on first camping trip of the season. This going out. And you will see me. Riding it up down the road a couple times. 
So stay tuned for that. But, you know, the power is in the hands of the viewers. What you want to see us do with this is what we are going to try to do. Money doesn't grow on trees around here, so we can only do so much, but we want the most baddest golf cart there is on the planet. We're not taking it to the drag strip, so we're not too Jay-Z swapping it or anything like that. But we want it to sound good. We want it to look good. We want to lift it. I already have plans in my head on how we're going to lift it and give it a wider stance. So it's going to be sweet. It's going to be epic. Let me know. I want to hear what Laura thinks <laughs> we should do to this here puppy. I know what you can do. You already know what I did in the I last one. I know. Oh, we didn't hop I, up the last no, one. No, I would love it lifted. It's already... And then if we could get like four-seater. So uh, it's going to be a four-seater. We're for the kids. That's part of my plan is four-seater because the last one kids had to ride their bicycles or we had to switch yeah. them out. And I'd love a stereo like we had last time. Oh, uh, you already know. You already <laughs> Listen, you guys already know we got to have the tunes. <laughs> we you already know. There's no question about that. Oh, we'll get the hookup. We'll go right to Horizon Audio. This is where we'll go. What else? Just make it look pretty. Get some LEDs on it. Get... She wants it to look pretty. So, some underglow lights. Underglow would be nice, yeah. We'll make it happen, Captain. We're going we're gonna to lift it, what? A couple of feet? Sounds good to me. Couple. I'm yeah. not talking inches. We're talking foots. Yep. So it's like four weeks. They don't make a tape yeah. measure for foots. Just the inches to add up to foots. Mm -hmm. So we're going to have to get the yard stick out. <laughs> but we got to keep her somewhat tame because it's going to be for the campground next yeah. year. We're thinking about going permanent. Yep. So and so they're cute. real strict. Not not really strict, but they're real strict. They don't want no hot rod. No. So, but it, and we trust us, guys. It's going to be, it's gonna be oh, epic, yeah. but it's going to be tamed down. And then we'll, maybe we'll have like a screw where we can take off to unleash the beast. What, when we're not at the campground mm -hmm. maybe you know maybe you have to put a willy bar on there or something you know i don't know possibilities are endless this thing's a pile of crap i know you guys like piles of craps so support the channel we want to thank you for the live stream uh money that you guys give us and we want to thank everybody that uh does already donate to the channel and help the channel grow and we are growing and we're growing fast and we like it. We have plans for this channel. And am I not doing everything I can do to, to make the channel grow? Because I have a set goal for the channel. I want it to be my everyday thing. But I can't do that until the revenue makes it happen. So once we're able to do that, um, content's just going to get better from there. So... Thanks, guys. We really appreciate it, don't, yes, don't, we, do. don't we? You know, I we really appreciate it, and there's nothing else I can really say other than thank you guys for everything that you guys have done. Because if it weren't for you guys, the channel it wouldn't be it wouldn't go around like it is. No. It, it, we would still be stuck on 200 freaking subscribers. Yeah. So and we're up to 2,600 or something like that now. So we thank you. From the bottoms of our hearts, and God bless. Peace.